this panel is, I think, 12 by 36. Um, this is a panel I bought with no idea what I was going to paint onto it. Um, typically, it's landscape oriented, so you would paint a landscape scene horizontally, but I, for some reason, wanted to turn it on its side and paint it upright. So more of a portrait style. Now, one thing when you have, I mean, with any composition, you want to create balance because a good composition always has some kind of harmony. And you can create harmony by repeating images, um, a triangle. You'll notice the moon to the castle to the second castle creates a bit of a triangle or sometimes an S shape. Now, because this canvas or panel rather is so big, I was able to incorporate a lot of those techniques into the composition itself. And I did use rule of thirds as well. So because it is 12 by 36, it was easily divided by three. And the first part is in the middle of the full moon and the other one is down here. So I did divide it into thirds, even though it looks quite bottom heavy. But I love that feeling of, you know, the full moon that's quite low in the sky. Um, hanging out over this little brook with a fairy village. There's going to be all kinds of magic and stuff added to this. Um, we're just getting the initial composition down. I'm perfecting the castles today. Take you a little closer. So you can see there's quite a lot of different colors, different layers and textures in there. Today we're going to perfect the turrets. I want to perfect some of these shadows and brighten up the toadstools themselves. Um, the island on the bottom, I've decided to extend, uh, to continue it off the picture plane. So I'm extending it to the edge of the canvas the way I've done with this other one up here. And that's just to create, again, more harmony in the composition. 